Hello, Carl here with Sustainability Theory News. We're over at UrbanOrganicGardener.com, and they got an infographic from CustomMade.com about vertical gardening supports in small spaces. All sorts of different options here that they're comparing. The stake, the cage, the tripod, the TP with some wire around it as well. There's also the A-frame, which can take up a bit of work. I'm a fan of stakes and string like the TP in the flat trellis because it doesn't cost too much for stakes and string. But then you get into the fence trellis and the arbor. These two options are great if you have a small garden that you want to, I don't know, decorate, if you will, have a aesthetic design to it. And uh, also you could grow food on these. Just try not to use... Uh, treated lumber chemicals too much on them have them be natural as much as possible and same with the pallet garden they even mention when you look for pallets make sure they have the ht for heat treated without use of chemicals and if there are chemicals then try to use flowers instead of edibles they go over instructions on how to instruct it the rain gutter garden um, and how to instruct that the shoe rack garden the tin can garden all sorts of different options and the living wall garden. It, look, basically, you take a bunch of gutters and strap them onto a wall. And uh, you can even wire those gutters to work as a hydroponic system. Anyway, that's from custommade.com. If you want to read more about it, you can follow the link in the description below. And if you'd like to see more news headlines like this, subscribe to my channel. Have a great day.